Hey everyone, it's Taylor with Iron Edge Group. Now, whenever you're logging into a computer, do you ever feel like it's kind of taken a little bit longer than it should? So today what we're going to do is we're going to discuss startup apps and how you can decrease the time it takes for you to get started working once you get logged in. So we're in a Windows 10 environment today, but this will also work in Windows 11. Now to do this, we're going to go ahead and we're going to take our mouse and we're going to go down to the start menu. Now, once we've clicked on the start menu, you'll notice that there's no search bar. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and do, we'll just start typing on our keyboard. And we're going to be typing in startup. And what we're looking for is this startup apps systems setting. We'll go ahead and click on that. And what this does is this shows all of the programs that are loading whenever we log into our computer. And it also tells us what kind of an impact that these programs are making. Now, the higher impact programs are going to take up more processing, more memory, and that's what's going to attribute to longer logging in times. So what we can do is we can go through this list, and whenever we come across something that we're not necessarily sure we want to start on boot up, we can turn it off. So for phone link, that's something I never use, so I can turn that off. Teams, maybe I want to load it manually. Once I, once I get logged in, we could turn that off as well. And now, the only thing to be careful for is if you don't recognize something, it's most likely just best to leave it alone. Or if you have any questions, you can always contact your IT provider, and they'll be happy to talk to you and explain any questions that you have. So that's all there is to it. Once you come into the startup apps, you can just adjust and test from here. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, go ahead and drop them in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and subscribe so we can get you all of our new latest content. Thanks.